to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be bringing you another Primark haul. I'm super excited to share this video with you guys because not only did I go to any Primark, I went to the brand spanking new Birmingham Primark. It's super, super cool that a Primark has been opened this big and has like cafes, salons, all sorts of different stuff going on. And to me, it's so overwhelming. And for someone who loves shopping and loves that whole experience of being out shopping, I just fell in love with it basically, the whole experience. It didn't look as big as the pictures were online. It did look like a normal traditional Primark, you know, as you're walking through the high street. However, once you were in there, it just felt like you was inside of a tire disc because it was absolutely huge. It took me and my sister over an hour and a half to drive there from Bristol, but it was totally worth it. We actually spent six hours inside of Primark. We had our breakfast in the Disney cafe, which was absolutely amazing. It was super, super cute. And then for lunch, we went down to the Mez restaurant cafe Cafe. I had the kids vegan burger and then my sister had the margarita pizza so yeah that was really really cheap as well it's £10 each for both meals everything just looked really really nicely laid out in the shop floor it just looked really presentable it wasn't as messy as the one I'm used to going to that's for sure so I really hope you guys enjoy watching this haul if you do please make sure to give this a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this in the future and without further ado let's get digging into my Primark bags so guys these are my shopping bags which I picked up from Primark I have a huge one here and then another one here I felt absolutely ridiculous carrying these through Birmingham but it was totally worth it and it balanced me out. Both bags are kind of like equal in weight as well, so I didn't feel too, you know, wibbly wobbly as I was wandering down the high street. But yeah, I bought quite a lot of stuff. I think the total amount which I bought was about £156, something like that, which is a lot, but I have bought a lot of stuff which I think you couldn't get anywhere else for that price to be honest. So first of all, the bags that I picked up were a pound each and they are reusable, which is super handy. So the first item which I'm gonna share with you guys is this little number here. And this one reminds me a lot of Mary Poppins. I am a huge fan of it. This one was four pounds and I just decided to go for this one because I don't actually have a summer hat that I like. And I am planning on going away in August to Benidorm with my mum for her 50th birthday. And I just thought it would be perfect to take with me. Just a nice size summer hat and I just fell in love with it. And for four pounds, you can't really go too wrong either. So very, very happy with this one. And I just think it's so cute, so summery and just, I don't know, very elegant and classy. So that's the reason why I picked this one up. On a boring note, I got some trousers for work. I don't have any black plain trousers to wear. So I, first of all, I picked up this pair here for 10 pounds, which is an absolute bargain. They are high-waisted they are wide-legged and they're just so so comfortable I can't express this enough so these are gonna be super handy they have got a belt as well which is very useful as you can see in a try on they look so so comfortable and yeah the only thing I need to do with these ones is just kind of bring them up a little bit because they are a little bit too long for me 10 pounds absolute steal and then this pair here is a short tight-fitted black trouser and I got these for five pounds which is an absolute bargain these weren't on sale they are the actual usual price which I thought was really really cheap I was gonna get two but but I had a lot of stuff in my basket. I just thought, no, do you know what? I just cannot buy any more. Um, so I just, you know, accepted the fact that I had a lot. And I think two pairs in different styles was enough. But yeah, these are cropped length. They are slim fitted. They aren't high waisted, but they just fit me perfectly. So yeah, they are just a pair of black trousers that I needed. So yeah, five pounds. You cannot go wrong at all. Then onto some turtleneck jumpers. I recently threw away quite a lot of them because they do kind of get quite tacky. So I needed to replace a few of them. And for that reason, I picked up two turtleneck jumpers one in a nice beige caramel kind of color and one in a natural gray shade the gray one that I had was just so tight I couldn't even fit in it I felt like a snake slithering back into its dead skin and it just wasn't pretty at all so I decided to throw that away in my recent wardrobe decluttering video so if you guys haven't seen that feel free to check it out these ones were six pounds each and I just thought they are so so comfortable super stretchy and they just feel really really nice next up we've got this cropped polo sleeveless shirt here which I picked up for two pounds in this sale which again is an absolute bargain this one is a nice pinky kind of shade I don't have a lot of pink t-shirts and I think I'm really really enjoying the more girlier feminine kind of colors lately I've just been finding myself kind of drawn to that at the moment so I'm just living for that moving on to this one again which I picked up in the sale rack this one was three pounds as well a nice nude and natural kind of shade perfect for summer and just all year round really just a nice basic t-shirt to wear again it's like a nice cropped length I bought this one in an extra large because I really wanted that baggier kind of vibe I am normally like a medium, but I just felt like, you know, I didn't want a cropped one. I wanted one that can kind of, you know, tuck into your trousers for summer, like a loose, casual, everyday kind of vibe. So that's the reason why I picked it up. Then moving on to this one here. 
I don't really know how I felt about cardigans until I rediscovered one in my wardrobe a couple of months ago and I just really really like the way it looked especially with like a summery dress you know just for the evenings in Britain it does get really cold during the evenings during summer and I just really really like that cardigan vibe with a nice maxi dress or something flowy so I stumbled across this one here it was £13 and it's just a nice beige natural cream colour and I picked this one up just because it'd be nice throw over. Even with this, what I'm wearing now, I think it looked really, really nice. I don't have anything beige like this in my wardrobe, just a nice cardigan. I threw away so many of those years ago because I was just done with them. And now I'm kind of really into them. I think this is going to fit in my wardrobe very, very nicely. So yeah, really excited to try this one out and wear it because yeah, I just love it. A couple of swimwear items which I picked up. I just, you know, stumbled across the swimwear range and there's so many different vibes going on. And I kind of went towards like, you know, natural kind of colors. This one here I picked up for three pounds. I really, really like the fact that it was like a nice brown shade. It's kind of slit down the front, which is really, really pretty. And then along the back, we don't really have much back going on, but it does kind of crisscross at the back. And yeah, this one was three pounds reduced from 10, which is an absolute bargain. I just thought, you know, can't go wrong for that. But then I also found this one here to go along with it, which is a nice swimwear cover-up. It's kind of like leopard print, zebra print, whatever you want to kind of call it. This one here was actually £6 reduced to two, which I just thought an absolute steal. So, so cheap and affordable. You know, I was actually quite surprised by this because it isn't actually marked as being on sale. So when it came up on the teal as £2, I was like, £5 for a complete, you know, swim set. <laughs> I can't even speak anymore, you know, it just blows my mind how affordable that is. So yeah, really, really impressed with this and I cannot wait to wear this on my holiday in August. Kind of similar to the previous items which I showed you there. I picked up this swimwear top here for £3 and then the bottoms here for 2 So again, £5 for a complete set. Absolute bargain. So yeah, really happy with this. And then the last swimwear item which I picked up is something that I've been looking for for such a long time. It's just that perfect blue swimsuit and I just haven't been able to find it anywhere. But I stumbled across this one, you know, out of the blue in the swimwear section and it's just kind of on the shelf. There was nothing else like it. I couldn't find like, you know, where they were all kind of kept. This one seemed to be the last one. Believe it or not, it's in my size. It was £12, which is kind of, you know, do I get it considering I've already got two there for £10, you know, two complete sets or do I leave it and walk away from it? I just thought, you know what? I have been looking for this kind of costume for such a long time now and £12, yeah, it's not too expensive, it's quite alright. It's padded and it's just the perfect kind of shade that I like and it's my favourite colour so I had to take it. And guess what guys, I had this scanned across the teal and it wasn't £12, it was £3 which again I just thought, you know, wow. I have got three swimwear costumes for £13 which to me is absolutely amazing and I feel absolutely great in all of them. I love the way they look. I tried them all on in the changing room and fell in love with the way they look. Yeah, really, really lovely and I cannot wait to wear this again on my holiday. So this next item I didn't actually buy on the sale which is very surprising for me because as you can see so far, a lot of the things that I bought have been on sale. But this one I found for £10 which is not too expensive at all. It's a nice nude beige brown kind of throw over jumper. It's just a nice long kind of fit and I just thought this would be so so comfortable to wear and take with me when I'm kind of travelling. This is a perfect summer jumper and I just thought you know you do get those rainy days during summer and through to autumn and winter this is kind of like a natural colour that would kind of carry through with me throughout and it's just a nice oversized casual fit which is perfect. So the next item we'll be showing with you guys is this pair of tartan trousers here. They are the peg leg fit and as you can see the colour is just amazing. I just fell in love with it. I just thought it was so so pretty. I do really struggle with picking up trousers that actually fit me so I'm really really happy that these do fit me really nicely. These ones were only £10 which to me is just again blows my mind because they are just such good quality material and they just feel amazing as well i love the fact we've got like a nice natural nude colors going through here we've got a little touch of pink as well which adds a nice feminine touch so two more items left for my first bag these two here picked up in the sale rack yet again and i honestly fell in love i keep saying this but i fell in love with this dress I tried it on, I just felt like, I don't know, I just felt like a little princess or something. I just felt really, really good in it. I love this colour so, so much. It's like a nice mint green kind of shade, which is just so, so nice. I felt like it really suited me, which is very rare for me to say. 
and especially when it comes to dresses like I haven't been a big fan of dresses over the years but this one just really suited me it's got white polka dots all down the front it's full length so it goes right down to the bottom as well we've also got this split down the middle as well which kind of just comes after the knee which is really really flattering this one was £10 reduced from 15 so just such an amazing steal and I cannot wait to find the perfect occasion to wear this on this is definitely my favourite out of all of them cannot you know fault this one at all it's just my fave so this one here i actually originally saw back in march or may when i did my previous primark spree and i really really liked it but i had so many different items in my basket already that i already fell in love with and i just couldn't really stretch out to buy anything more and i just thought you know i had quite a few jumpsuits and playsuits already but then to discover this one in the sale section for seven pounds i just thought you know what i'm definitely going to get it this time around can't say no to seven pounds because it is literally a whole outfit in one when it comes to jumpsuits it's just so easy to pair with just adds a lot of summeriness to my wardrobe and i'm really looking forward to trying this out as soon as i can it is full length as well which to me is something that i need because a lot of the clothes that i have at the moment are kind of cropped or culotte style because obviously as you guys know i'm very obsessed with that at the moment i'm trying my best to kind of you know clear myself away of buying so much of that so that is everything in my first bag onto my second bag so in this bag here we do have a lot more like bulkier items so hopefully it won't be too long digging through it all so first up we've got this item here which i picked up in the homeware section it is this very very pretty palm leaf light up led light in my study room at the moment it's kind of um turned into like my indoor garden where i've got a lot of plant based kind of wall features and decorations and stuff like that so i just thought it'd be a nice touch to that i'm really into like homeware and you know decorations and stuff like that so i just thought it would be perfect for my study room really so yeah so on to footwear honestly i have so many different pairs of shoes now it's getting a little bit out of control i can't you know can't lie about that but there are just a few things that are kind of missing within my shoe range believe it or not so i've got this pair of white plain sneakers which i don't actually own it's just something that i've really really needed in my wardrobe so many different ways i can kind of wear this and make an outfit more kind of casual and chilled and laid back these are just very very plain though got a little bit of heel to them as well which is kind of nice but yeah these ones were 12 pounds and like i said i just bought them because they were something that i felt was just missing really in my wardrobe i don't own anything like this so that's the reason why i got them so the next pair of shoes i've got to share with you guys are these ones here and these are just so so bright and colorful and i don't actually own anything like this within my shoe collection i have a lot of nude beige browns and blacks but nothing like colorful and bright these ones are wide fit and they were six pounds and then the last pair of shoes that which i picked up are these sliders here i thought they were so fun colorful perfect for beside the pool and they have watermelons all along the front which i thought was very very summery these ones were only four pound which i just thought was amazing so on to accessories i picked up two packs of hair clips as you can see i've got four in my hair at the moment I absolutely love this trend, it's so so pretty and just adds such a nice little touch to my hair. So I picked up this pack here for £2, we've got Love, we've got the K obviously for Cora and we've got two random clips here so I can play around with those. This one here was £3, which has got basic gold and you know pearled clips to add into my hair as well. So yeah, I really really like these and I just think they're so pretty. Four more items left, these next two are uh, something that I found in Corfu when I went with my friends in May and that was a wardrobe refresher hangers and basically you pop these into your wardrobe and they make your wardrobe smell absolutely amazing and I've never heard of these before I don't know why I don't know if you guys have ever heard of them either um but these are just so so nice I got these in the cashmere and vanilla flower scent I found these ones in a homeware section for £1.50 each so £3 altogether and it says they last between four weeks so hopefully that will be the case and I cannot wait to try these out because they smell absolutely amazing I'm obsessed with them so yeah I highly recommend trying these ones out if you haven't already so two more items left this next one here is a large side bag which kind of you know goes over your body kind of like that so I've decided to go for this one here not only because I really, really like it and I just thought it was very pretty and I love the color of it and it was only 10 pounds but I decided that when I go on holiday and when I'm traveling quite a lot I do struggle with wearing backpacks all day especially if you're walking for hours and hours and you've got all that bulk on your back it's just so so you know tiring draining and exhausting so I just thought you know with a little shoulder bag like this I can kind of keep everything here feel safe because you know it's kind of on my body and in front of me and I can kind of fit everything that I need into here and then the last item which I picked up is another colorful item and I really really like this and it's something that I've been missing for such a long time is a nice summer beach bag this one was eight pounds which again 
isn't too bad at all. I just fell in love with this one and then paired with the hat and my little sandal that I have, I think it's be so cute and summery to take with me on holiday. So really looking forward to actually having a beach bag just to throw my towel in there, my sunglasses, sun cream, water bottle and things like that. So yeah, that is everything from my Primark haul. I really hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video. If you did enjoy and you have already been to Birmingham Primark, please let me know in the comment section down below what you guys thought of the experience there or if you are looking forward to going in the future. I definitely recommend it is only an hour and a half from Bristol and you can get trains coaches and stuff like that to get to Birmingham as well so if you are looking at it I definitely recommend let me know down in the comment section below which item was your favorite out of this entire haul I love to hear what you guys have to say and what your opinions are personally as I said before my favorite items have to be the blue polka dot maxi dress and the summer hat and the bag I think they're so so pretty if you guys enjoyed watching this type of video again please make sure to give this a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more from me i also have an instagram and twitter account both of which are world of cora if you want to check those out and see more from me when i'm not on youtube so yeah that's all for me today thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye